David Ayer took to Twitter yesterday and it wasn't to share his new Netflix trailer Bright or to talk about what he might have done different in Suicide Squad. Instead, he shared just one picture, a picture that has sent DC fans into speculation mode. Thanks to the tweet and image, many fans now believe that Black Mask will be the main villain for his upcoming DC spinoff, Gotham City Sirens. Ayer will be reteamed with Margot Robbie's Harley Quinn for the movie that is also rumored to include Catwoman and Poison Ivy. The movie is currently in development with a release date not yet to Determined. Schnepp, with the way directors are using social media, do you think Ayer is telling us that Black Mass is actually going to be in his Gotham City Sirens? Um, absolutely not. Yes, he's saying Black Mask <laughs> is going to... Black Mask, meet Red Skull. If people don't know who Black <laughs> Mask is, uh, he wasn't in the Oscar-winning movie Suicide Squad, but he's going to be in Gotham City Sirens for sure. He's a great villain. He's one of Batman's villains. So I am very excited to see a character that hasn't gotten any shine in any really media, of like, I think animated a little bit. But... Uh, as far as live action, nothing. So I can't wait to see the, well, you got some video gameplay too, but not in the movie yet. So here we go, Black Mask. Jeremy? Yeah, uh, I, I agree that the one time Black Mask was supposed to get shine was in the game Batman Arkham Origins. Right. And it ended up he didn't get shine. So some fans felt like they got kicked in the balls yeah. about it. They're like, what? I just, it was supposed to be. So they didn't really get it. I still like the game, but I understand. So I'm glad Black uh, Black Mass is going to get something. Roman Sionis is a good villain. You know, he's a, he's a crime kingpin, you know? And uh, as someone who said, no, nope, Pierce Brosnan's probably not going to be Cable because of the picture that was tweeted. Yeah, I'm going to say Black Mask is going to be in here because I ain't falling for that twice. I don't make the mm. same mistake twice, friends. It's real. Hey. Yeah, normally I'd be saying, calm yourselves, people. It's just a tweet. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean anything. But I think it might have been the Hollywood Reporter article pointed <laughs> out that this is kind of what Ayer did with Suicide Squad. And a lot of that proved to be true. Right. He's very vocal on Twitter. So... I'm going to assume at this point that this is happening, and I'm excited about it. I didn't know all that much about Black Mask. and Just you know, look at him. Well, look how scary he but is. But that's the thing. I just look at him, and my horror-loving brains is like, <laughs> creepy dude, I want to see him. And then I started looking up the False Face Society. I want to see that in live action. That could be batshit crazy, and now I am just praying that this is true, and that's what the movie's going to be. As long as David Ayer isn't pulling Vin Diesel, where he's like putting up a bunch of different pictures, mm. trying to just kind of troll the audience into guessing <laughs> what was going to happen. I, I think this is true. I think Black Mask will be the villain of Gotham City Sirens. I'm still not sure why they're doing this movie, as opposed to just a true Harley Quinn spinoff film, <laughs> having her, Catwoman, and Poise the Ivy together. I know Black Mask has a history with Catwoman, I just I think I would have preferred just a solo Harley Quinn movie with 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 the Joker. But this is a really cool way to introduce not only a lot of the other female characters like Catwoman, but this is a good way to introduce uh, Batgirl. Okay, a, that's why I think that's the secret little that she's at, this is her backdoor entrance. So. Uh, um, just a side note to what you were saying before about the uh, Oscar-winning Suicide Squad. You know what movie doesn't have an Oscar? Martin Scorsese's Silence. <laughs> so, you have Suicide Squad, Oscar winning, Silence. Uh, Sorry, not Dennis. So much. Silence does not deserve an Oscar. Uh, well, they could have gotten an Oscar for some There's of many other Scorsese movies that should have won. It had a great cinematography in it. Um, all right, uh, what's next? <laughs>